Uh, by the way, VI in this context is not six, but like virtual oh, intelligence. Oh, VI. Oh, might be. <laughs> yeah, I didn't even. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Silly me. Understandable. Silly. The game uses Roman numerals elsewhere. Uh. Presidio. Oh, well. No rewards. Flux, we're not going to the casino. Open up. You can also swing by the the, the doctor's office on your right there. Get some free. Uh... Oh wait, no, it was right. before. No, it was over there, yeah, all the yeah, way. Yeah. Okay, whatever. Get some free gel. Uh, I think I replenished on the ship. Then you're good. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Fast oh, travel. Sure, this could work, right? Mm -hmm. Wars location. Uh, which one would be the closest? What are you looking for? Uh, the lower wards. Uh, to go see Zabaleta. I think you could take the stairs right there. Yeah, I'm right actually. there. Actually, I thought uh, you uh, take the you can take these to get to the the council to see Kohaku, but otherwise, just hit the stairs. Hey, Conrad, uh, Commander, I've been waiting for you to get back. Yeah, I've got an idea, and I wanted to run it by you. I've got a lot going on right now, but I can spare a moment. Great. This will just take a minute. With so many human colonies being attacked, I'm not sure that one specter is enough. What? What if you signed me on as another specter? Put in a good word for me, bro. Conrad, I haven't been shot in the head nearly enough times to make that seem like a good idea. <laughs> joke if you want, but there were people who didn't believe in you, and you worked out, right? I know you're afraid to trust people after losing your team at a ah! cruise, but I'd never let you down. Options? Here's a test. <laughs> Let's talk about trust. <laughs> mm -hmm. Alright, let's see. I'm a bad guy. Stop me from killing you. What? No, please. Please don't hurt me. Why are you doing this? This is how a gun in your face feels. It happens to me every day. You can't handle this. <laughs> I thought you were a hero. Heroes don't do things like this. I wish I'd never met you. Damn, dude. Whatever. <laughs> Fucking weak little... <laughs> Well, that, that went one way. <laughs> God. <laughs> oh, I shit. I can't believe he's married, too. Oh, wow. Someone thought he was worth something? Ridiculous. How am I going with this? Upper markets, upper wards. Wait, uh, did I miss Zabaleta? Make me a specter, too. <laughs> <sighs> Wards access corridor just off the presidium. Oh shit, is this not the location? Um, sorry, uh, to upper markets, uh, the other staircase, uh, to lower markets. Whoa. There was a, there was a, there was a direct, uh, stair that goes from upper to lower. He wouldn't ask me if he could be a specter, like it was some kind of like joy club. Yeah. Like, yeah, make me one. This thing that just happened, <laughs> that just existed. It's a cool, I, I, I'm cool. I don't need rules. Make me above the law too. Oh, it's a little corner here. All right. So. Uh, that marker is not helping me. Um, here, check your map. Uh, just, just highlight the, the, the exit points and see what they say. So. Lower wards. Okay, that's lower wards. Uh, what's the, what are the other ones? The, at the end of the alleyway? Lower market, Citadel Rapid Transit, Presidium, Flux, CSEC Academy, Rapid Transit. Okay, um... Hit the rapid transit. Whoops. 
Uh, okay, go to Presidium Locations. Uh, go to Wards Access. Oh. Proceed okay. down the stairs to reach the wards. So you should be on this path, right? <laughs> Area map name. <laughs> Did you see that? Yep. <laughs> yep. Good shit. It's good. Am I low enough? There we go. C class. Uh, Civil Tower represent rise access. I mean, is this the way? Towards. Reporter Kalisa Algilani recently attempted to land an interview with Commander Shepard, the first human specter. Commander Shepard answered difficult questions, demonstrating that under that military uniform is a keen diplomatic mind. We'll have exclusive footage <laughs> later today. Yes. Keen diplomat. Shepard loves the press. Is he drunk again? He seems okay. He's not wobbling or or anything. His eyes look glossy, though. Hey, back again, huh? I don't suppose you got any credits to spare. I spoke to my mother. She told me about what happened on Mindoir. Oh, did she? I wonder. People tie like prize hogs, locked in cages, clawing and screaming as they're loaded into cargo pods. And we couldn't reach them. The Batarian defenses had us pinned. Dozens died trying to advance. All we could do was watch as they hauled people away. I've been looking for 13 years for something to make that sight go away. What have you got, huh? Damn. I'm not going to give you money to drink yourself to death. You need to stop this. If you don't have a better option... Oh boy. Just give me 20 credits. A good bottle of whiskey. Enough to stop the dreams. It's like he got drunk during the conversation. <laughs> His voice just went like... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I can't I can't go mean on the guy who needs help. Who is Red Shepherd? I I don't know. You tell us, man. I'm going to help the man. I'm going to be blue with him. My mother said to go to the Veterans Affairs office. You're not the only one who's seen that brand of hell. They can help. The VAO. God. All right. If she wants me to go talk to someone, fine, I'll do it. For her. She always stuck up for me. <laughs> she always was naive. All the VAO does is pump you full of chemicals. If she wants to talk, tell her she can reach me through the Citadel VAO. Level up. All right. See, I helped. Okay, where are you at? Where'd the blue points put you? Uh... Big blue. Big blue. Big paragon. What a good guy. I know, right? Impressive. I know, I know, I know. Master unity. Half health. 100% shields. Uh, I could max this out. Infiltrator. <laughs> Where I've got a problem. <laughs> that must be so rude. That was be messed up. What would my mom say? <laughs> right? What would she say? Exactly. I'm try I'm trying. Conrad though. Mm-hmm. He needed to mm -hmm. have someone set him straight, you know? Because you can't you can't you can't live in a fantasy world like Nothing that. Set you straight like a like a gun to the face. <sighs> Jeez, like Parasocial relationships is one thing, mm -hmm. but this is this is just madness. Gun like, to the face. Mm. Overload, advanced overload, I like the sound of that. Master overload, three more points. Yeah, I'm using my sniper a lot. Two 
points for you. Can't unlock anything, but I could help you first aid a bit better. Or max out one of your abilities that I love so much. You could max out a sorry scientist. Oh, that's big numbers. Whoa. I, th I noticed that when you look around the upgrades, you don't often go to the bottom specialist no. tab. No. But uh, not not to push, just, you yeah, know, yeah, no. it, don't forget to look down there, too. He's a full-on battle master. Uh... Yeah, we'll see how good this is. That's good. All right. I am not used to this kind of environment. Too much time working by myself, I suppose. There are a few unlicensed vendors who operate out of the markets here. Sometimes they have good stuff for sale. He has a cool voice. First time I was here, I dropped a bundle in the casino. <laughs> Got so mad I put my fist through one of the machines. <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> That's the thing that can happen. Yep. All right. Uh, up next, Spectre business: pointing guns at fans and sobering up the fucking drunks. Get him an egg McMuffin. You? No, I'm done. I'm done. Not, I, no egg McMuffin for me. Fair enough. It's just that that was. I mean, I'm not, I'm not the guy. Yeah. But I do know that, like, those are hangover cures, as is Putin. Kahoku is at the Citadel Tower. Yeah, I had a rotten egg McMuffin once. Oh, well, that's just unfortunate. So never again. I mean, that, yeah, you've been imprinted. Yeah. Uh, with the bad, that oh, man. one bad memory is all it takes to, to ruin foods forever, especially at a, at a, a younger age. Oh. But um, on a list of like things that help absorb and cure hangovers, the uh, egg McMuffin was like high on the list as like one of the top hangover the cures. Group that had accused the Genetics Corporation of fraud. The Krogan Group had contracted this. Binary Helix to perform. Press A to skip. Did you hear that one? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Binary Helix. Another corp. They, they run the world. Who runs the world? Corpse. Who runs the world? Corpse. <laughs> Who runs the world? Corpse. <laughs> Who runs this motherfucker? <laughs> <laughs> what a banger. <laughs> just a Sunday friend, you know, just dancing. Whoops. Careful there. I feel like I was super confused. The tower. Who runs the world? Yes. Corpse. Let all races Corpse. The glory of the enkindlers who raised them all to enlightenment. I wonder if Avina has more things to say. Where there was only darkness, the enkindlers. Please do not disturb the keepers. Welcomed. For your convenience, yes, this yes, is yes. programmed with information on Nothing the, at all. the relay monument and not the unless someone edits Thank you and for updates using it. Avina. I'll find a way to disactivate deactivate her. Why? Because I want to scan that thing. <laughs> Have a pleasant day. Literally I can't even B Jesus. <laughs> what a waste. Alright, Citadel Towers. Oh, right behind me. Can you actually not scan him? No, because she's being an idiot. Please do not disturb oh. the keepers. That's why I'm trying to like hmm. bash her head in, but it's not letting me. Please do not disturb the keepers. Hmm. Anyhow. Um No, I I think you, you might have already done so and gotten your reward, and that prompt is just her line. 
Yeah, I don't think that's actually a thing. I couldn't scan? No, I think the first time you looked at him, you might have already, well, already scanned the first time and gotten the reward. Oh. But now this is just prompting her line. I see. Weird. I believe, but could be wrong. In breaking news, Chairman Burns of the Parliament Subcommittee on Transhuman Studies has been kidnapped by biotic extremists. Oh. The biotics commandeered a freighter and were last seen in the Hades Gamma Cluster. No demands have yet been made. Hostage situation. Do 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 do. Wop 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 wop. Fun times. No one to talk to here. No banter. Oh, hello. I really appreciate what you're doing for me. Please let me know as soon as you find any information on my brother. Will do. Nobody here. Shepard, could I have another word with you? Hello again, Commander. I've got a proposition for you. Mm -hmm. Since you helped me get information on the crime syndicate, I've gotten a lot more backing from my publishers. I'm investigating traffic controller conditions now, and I wondered if you could help. That seems like a step down from wide-scale corruption. Actually, in a way, it's more important. This isn't about people getting rich. This is about safety. I've heard rumors that the space traffic controllers are overworked to a dangerous degree. I can't get into the control room, but you could. If you planted a bug inside, I could crack the story. If you crack this story, what's likely to happen? Ideally, there will be calls to improve working conditions by hiring more controllers and upgrading systems. The council won't pay for improvements voluntarily. This story will provide that pressure. Oh. Or you'll overhear some salacious shit and tabloid it. Huh. What will this bug allow you to pick up? Just audio and video. I'm not trying to tap into the traffic control system if that's what you're worried about. That's not what I'm worried about. I just about. need to hear and see them in order to correlate their activity with traffic efficiency. Everyone knows space traffic controllers are overworked. How is this news? There's a difference between overworked and dangerous. Traffic at the Citadel has increased by 300% in the last century, but traffic controller resources haven't kept up. Oh. We already have several last-minute wave-offs per week. Do we have to wait for a full-blown disaster? Also, if we happen to find out that Benefer is coming to town, then that's pretty cool, too. <laughs> win, win, win. Oh, yeah, didn't they get back together? It's something like that. Yeah, it's crazy. This bug you want me to play. Could it interfere with traffic signals? Absolutely not. I made certain that the frequencies it uses won't interfere with anything. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. I can't promise anything, but I'll see what I can do. Give me the bug. Excellent. Just place it on a terminal with a good view of the area. Thanks again for your help. In the long run, this story is going to save lives. again is there a problem i'm not detecting any signals from the bug yet <laughs> interesting <laughs> i did it uh, what <laughs> or don't hold your breath <laughs> oh it's tempting who's red shepherd oh! <laughs> sometimes you sweat the red decisions sometimes you just fly to them yeah and everyone is thoroughly on the edge of their seats confused because nobody can figure out what the fuck this character is or what is happening <laughs> so no i kind of want to put the bug down i kind of want to put could you tell me where you want me to plant the bug again in a space traffic control room, ideally on a terminal that gives me a good view of the room. I'll let you know when it's done. Goodbye. I'll do. I'll do the thing. I'll do the thing. No, well, there you go. All right. No, I'm waiting to speak with one of the counselor's assistants. Commander Shepard, isn't it? 
My name is Admiral Kahoku. Is there something I can do for you? You sent a recon team out into the Artemis Tau cluster? Yes, that's right. They went missing a few days ago. I've been trying to find out what happened to them, but I keep getting the runaround from Alliance Brass. Do you know something about this, Commander? I found them. What was left of them. They ran into a Thresher Maw. A Thresher Maw? That's not... My men wouldn't just stumble into a Thresher Nest. Not the entire unit. Somebody lured them there with an Alliance Distress Beacon. Placed it perfectly so they'd land right beside the Thresher Nest. Damn it. I had a bad feeling about this ever since my team disappeared. An Alliance Beacon used as bait. My unit wiped out. And nobody seems to know anything about it. Commander, I appreciate what you did. Now I need to do my part. The families of those Marines deserve to know why they died. Captain Anderson said you had information on Baines. Not as much as I'd like to. One of my crews found him, frozen stiff on board a derelict vessel. The missing recon group? The one I sent you to find? They were scouting the system we found Baines's ship in. Mm. Anything you need from me? Not right now, Shepard, but I'll let you know as soon as I find something out. And he's gone? Yep. There appears to be a distress signal coming from the Sarlacc pit. <laughs> Aha! Man. Yep, there you go. Alright, that's done. Updates to the journal. Yep, planting a bug. Go to Citadel Security and plant the bug in the Citadel Traffic Control Center near the back of C-Sec. I could do that. Anything else to do around here, though? No, we can't go back to the Presidium, right? Not, not, not unless you want to fucking ding-dong dash the, the council. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good, I'm good. Just leave a bag of flaming poop. Oh, I can use this, right? If you do want to, yeah, if you do want to plant it, it's yeah. at C-Sec. That's where we're going. Do the deed now. Okay. So. Go to the offices, I guess. Keep going uh, to the edge of that. There you go. That's good. That's pretty good. And I am right there. See, Emily and I were, were good friends, mm -hmm. right? Space TMZ, no problem. Hello, Commander. Can't help you right now. Fine. What's up, Chelik? Anything new? Not now. <laughs> Fine. I'm a busy man, too. I mean, after last time, I don't think he was looking to deal with your shit. <laughs> <laughs> he started it. I think. <laughs> Inconspicuous location. Go back to Emmy. Yep. That's fair. It was the Turians who first suggested creating a single organization to maintain order on the Citadel. Perhaps that is why more than half the force is Turian. Skill still too low? Yep. With the party too. Mm -hmm. with, well, with those people in particular. Alright. Uh, no. I used the fast travel, right? Yep, back to Emily. Uh, and that would be right here. Mm -hmm. Hello. I'm already getting readings. 
This is gonna make a great story. Thank you so much for your help. Here, this is everything I've got from my publisher's budget. It better be a good cause. It was no problem. <laughs> good luck with your story. It deserves to be heard. I appreciate your support. I hope this will save some lives in the long run. Thanks again for your help. I'm gonna show this to my publisher. Paragon 2. And she's gone. Up next, um, Citadel, we're still scanning the keepers. Yeah, I, think I guess did. we can. I think you did it. Go travel at this point. Mm -hmm. Converge, family armor, and the moon stuff. Cool. So let's just go back on the ship, and we can go to Noveria, maybe. That you can. Let's go. Uh, no. C sec. Cool, cool, cool. And to the docking bay. In remembrance of Eden Prime, we present another profile in courage with serviceman Nirali Bhatia. Another? A devoted wife and talented oh, chef, same. serviceman Bhatia joined the Alliance military under the deferred education plan. Don't Yo. want to hear about uh, your choices, huh? <laughs> <laughs> what a shame. Oh, 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 oh. Strange. Aha! I did not see that point of interest earlier. Yeah. Little, little bits of codex. Oh, this goes down low. What about the other side? What's the sound? Is there a battle brewing? No? That's, that's not the sound of a battle. <laughs> <gasps> Who wants to fight? Red is looking for some action. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. Red, I know you like to move around during Lord, decontamination. It works less board. well when Exo you move around. Don't tell me what to do. Just, just so you know. Don't make me pull rank on you. I do what I want. Okay. Codex. Like, politely help the journalist. <laughs> Very politely. Oh, can you um, use the mouse to uh, give me the, the proper entry? I hope two fixes this. Ablative armor. Uh, warships, kinetic barriers reduce the damage from solid objects, but can do nothing to block guardian lasers, particle beams, and other forms of directed energy weapon. DEW. Do. The inner layer of warship protection consists of ablative armor plate designed to boil away when heated. The vaporized armor material scatters a dew beam, rendering it ineffectual. A scaffold is built around the interior pressure hull, with sheets of ablative armor hung from the structure. Ships typically have multiple layers of armor, separated by empty baffles, spaces often used for cargo storage. Cruisers, which lack the internal space to fit dedicated fighter hangars, store the shipboard fighter complement in the baffles. It is not unknown for an uh, enlisted crew to build illicit alcohol distilleries in some obscure corner of the baffles, safe from prying arm eyes. Get that, that moonshine. Mm -hmm. Make you go blind. Or my Mars shine. Or fucking <laughs> whatever's next. Alright. So zoom out. Zoom out. Zoom out. Yeah. Novaria. Here we go. And um, just so you know, I, yeah, I think you, you you gained new dots uh, of the top layer as well. Okay. With those side missions. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so Norvea is there. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, let's... We can check this first, right? Mm -hmm. Council looking at us leave. Oh, thank window. God he's gone. Oh, God. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <gasps> Zap. Message for you, Commander. Just came in over a secure channel. Shepard, this is Admiral Kahoku. I found out who set that trap for my men. The ones killed by the Thresher Moor. Damn, I hope you get this message. It was a group called Serpers. An Alliance Black Ops organization. Top secret, highest level security clearance. They vanished a few months ago. Dropped right off the grid. Nobody knew where they went or what they were up to. They've gone completely rogue, Shepard. They're conducting illegal genetic experiments, trying to create some kind of super soldier. Oh no. I don't have any proof, but I found the coordinates for one of their research worlds. I'm uploading them with this message. They're completely out of control. Somebody needs to stop them. I've done my part. Now it's up to you. This is... This is probably the last you'll hear from me. Cerberus is after me now. Oh, damn. I need to disappear before they find me. Okay. Cerberus. And he's gone? You wanted action? You yeah. got it. <laughs> the Salagon. Standard hydrogen helium gas giant, the Sargon's atmosphere is tinted blue by trace quantities of methane. Cool, cool, cool. Xawin. Uh, level 1 cold hazard. Minus 131 Celsius? Yeah, that's pretty cold. Mm -hmm. uh, Xawin has a thin atmosphere of carbon, carbon dioxide, and ethane. The surface is frozen and mainly composed of cobalt with deposits of copper. Planet side conditions are hazardous with constant high storms, ice storms racking the surface. And then, Trellin. Trellin is a lifeless rock with trace atmosphere of xenon and krypton. Its surface contains large amounts of iron and magnesium silicates. Due to heavily cratered terrain, starships are discouraged from landing. A Salarian religious cult claims that a certain pattern of overlapping craters in the southern hemisphere resembles, resembles their goddess. Okay. Seeing Jesus in toast and stuff? Yep. Alright. And Tired of Turin. Tara. And Titara is a standard hydrogen helium gas giant with traces of ammonia. Hydrocarbons in the atmosphere lend it a distinct brown tint. Ooh, large concentration of helium th helium three. You think like gas terraforming is just like just get a bunch of cows, drop them on a planet with tons of grass, and just let them fart it up for a couple <laughs> centuries? <laughs> Come back a few years later, and now you've got a Volus. Uh, now you got a Volus planet. <laughs> Man, farmers get farmers. Uh. Yunthoral. Shrouded by a thick atmosphere of complex hydrocarbons, Yunthoral has never been fully mapped. The surface is hot and completely covered by a global ocean of liquid hydrocarbons. There are indications of primitive organic life developing deep within the global ocean. A medallion was recovered. An ancient deep space probe slowly orbiting Yunthoral. Thali brought it on board, dismantled it, and found a League of One medallion hidden in its payload. League of One. Yun... Y Yuri Lowenthal. <laughs> <laughs> All bunched up and jumbled up. And that was it. No asteroid belt. So we are leaving. Let's go to peace. Okay. Veles. 
Veles has a thin atmosphere of xenon and krypton. Most of the materials are frozen and fallen as snow. Its surface is composed of potassium with deposits of magnesium. While investigating the primitive anaerobic life of Veles, binary helix survey the teams discovered a cunningly hidden anchorage of the ancient Krogan warlord Moro. Many records and artifacts of the Krogan rebellions were recovered and sold at auction. The empty base is now abandoned. Matrak writing recovered. Mm -hmm. A small abandoned vessel and the salvage team brought the ship on board and dismantled it, whereupon they discovered one of the Matrak Dilinaga's writings. No matter how deep into space we go and what we find, the periodic table still relevant. Still useful. Everything positioned as it needs to, indicating what type of shit you're going to find that what the planets are made up of. Yeah. Morana is an icy planet towards smaller than an Earth's moon. Many planet planetary geologists suspect it was once an Oort cloud, ice dwarf, which migrated inwards to after an encounter with some other body. While the crust is frozen water ice, deep layers are mostly silicates with pockets of magnesium and aluminum. Morana is tidally locked to Pax. The same side always faces the sun. Interesting. Avaria? Where we're going? Avaria is a small frozen terrestrial world, barely habitable by conventional definitions. It is privately chartered by the Novaria Development Corporation, who lease out labs to perform research too dangerous or controversial to be performed elsewhere. Given Novaria's unique situation, it is the source of many wild conspiracy theories. Minus one Celsius. Oh, doable. And the inner ring of Sm Svarog. Small but typical hydrogen and helium gas giant whose orbit lies quite close to the star. It is unusual for a star with close orbit orbiting gas giant to have a habitable world. Zvarog is Pax's only gas giant, but its temperature, powerful winds, and high orbital velocity make it a poor candidate for helium-3 mining. While Noveria enjoys plenty, plentiful deuterium for its fusion plants, it's, it imports all of its helium-3 from out system. And that is it. Norveria, here we come. Approach control, this is the SSV Normandy, requesting a vector and a berth. Normandy, arrival was not scheduled. Our defense grid is armed and tracking you. State your business. Citadel business. We got a Council Spectre aboard. Landing access granted, Normandy. Nice. Be advised, we will be confirming identification on arrival. If confirmation cannot be established, your vessel will be impounded. Whoa. What a fun bunch. I think I'll take my next leave here. <laughs> wow. Better put away your fake Spectre Pass. Wow, is genuine. It is real. Unstamped. Okay. I got all the ID I need right here. Sir, those are subway stamps. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think they have more things to say? Probably not, right? Commander, good to no. see you. Okay. So no, okay. Good. And then here is Tally. Nothing. You wanna land? Yeah, let's let's step out then. Man, I remember like hearing stories of like people robbing subways yep. for the. That's why they killed it. Yeah, they f they stole the roll, <laughs> and then you couldn't trust all the free sandwiches anymore, because stolen roll. Who would have thought? And then they replaced the roll with a different type, and it's still yeah, totally. Oh, all the way there. So, who we rolling with? Good question. That's a very good question. So, this... Oh, hold up. Cerberus. Investigate the Yangtze system. On Bintu. Valuable minerals. Yes, we are searching for minerals. 
in the Codex. Castle races. Salarians. League of One, yeah. Before they joined the Citadel Council, the Salarians' most potent military tool was a small reconnaissance team known as the League of One. Their primary training was in espionage and assassination. Never more than a dozen strong, the team was adept at infiltrating the tightest defenses and eliminating all necessary obstacles. One of a few top members of government and military were privy to the League's identities. League members wore no distinguishing garments and held no particular rank. The only evidence of their partic participation in the League was a small medallion presented to each member upon induction. This secrecy was maintained until the formation of the Council. In an effort to dispel rumors and appease their new Asari partners, the Salarian Union released all classified documents pertaining to the League. The League of One was suddenly exposed in an, in, and in danger of being hunted by enemies of the Salarians. Before, before any harm could be done, the team mysteriously disappeared. Most assumed this was a convenient lie to help hide their identities, but a few months later, the inner cabinet was murdered. Though there are no incriminating evidence, it was clear who was responsible. Realizing the threat posed by this rogue outfit, the special task group dispatched a team of hunters. When they didn't return, the STG dispatched 10 of its brightest operators with broad discretionary powers. Only two returned. They reported no evidence of the League. No further incidents were reported, and it was assumed the League was wiped out. Some recently declassified documents, however, have suggested there may be, there may have been a 13th member who eluded the Salarian military. Da -da -da. Right. So, um, okay, let's get Rex in. Mm -hmm. And uh, who else hasn't been there? I feel like I haven't rolled with Garrus for a bit. Uh, that being said, I'm looking at like the strength for biotic tech and combat. I do want to ro roll with Garrus. Garrus is cool. Yeah, let's do it. Let's get that boys in. I like that team. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Uh-oh. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. Cool. All right, dress him up. Hot dog. Mm-hmm. All right. And Garrus is good with assault rifle and snipers, I presume. I assume. Mm-hmm. Let's give you a few points here, a few points there. This much. At least one here. So you're an agent. We can max that out. And now, what do we do? Okay. Assault training. Yes. That sounds good. Let's give you one here. One, two, three, four, five. Damn, no first dates. I guess you'll have to fulfill the task for now. Not bad. And the last point will go in... Oh! Damage and accuracy, or slight damage and melee damage. No, let's 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 give you this. I'm already sniping. That's good. That's good. That is good. All right. Let's explore. 